Hi guys, my name is uh, Martin Beuker. I'm a co-founder of uh, Tweede Hans. It's um, second hand. It's a classified ads uh, platform in the Benelux. It's a peer-to-peer -peer, um, consumer marketplace. And um, uh, we're, uh, as I said, in Benelux, but we're also market leader in Belgium. Uh, Belgium, a uh, population of 11 uh, million people, internet capita of 8.5. It's a bit of a growth market because it's not so totally developed in, in the in internet uh, industry, but uh, that's good for us. We can still grow some more there. Um, some facts, brief facts about uh, the um, uh, Tweede Hans platform. It's uh, 16 million uh, visits a month. We have over uh, 300 million page views a month. We're uh, very large in cars. Uh, furthermore, the, 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 the most attractive part of the, the website is everything like in and around the house. And um, uh, fashion is also pretty large in kids and babies, stuff like that. This is where we are um, um, attractive for the Belgian population. So this is uh, one of my favorite movies. It's Scarface and uh, the beautiful Elvira gives uh, Tony Montana a lesson. And uh, that's lesson number two. I don't know if you know uh, what that lesson is. Does anybody know it? Lesson number two in Scarface. Lesson number two is uh, don't get high on your own supply. And um, today I will try to um, convince you that I disagree with this lesson. And uh, well, probably I'm right because eventually in the movie they'll die. But um, I have a project to which, uh, with which I'm going to prove that. So this is my house. It's a, a house in the city center of Amsterdam. It's a um, typical canal house. And uh, when I bought it, I had to renovate it and uh, interior decorate it. So we uh, tore it down completely from the inside. We uh, did a complete renovation, a lot of work, uh, new drawings, uh, all the family helping out and uh, new electricity, new plumbing, and uh, even concrete, the floors in the house. We had to do everything. And in the meantime, my son was drawing on the sofa, and um, so we had to also decorate it completely new, buy new bathroom furniture, new kitchen, we had to... Uh, lights, everything we had to, to, to buy new, and uh, of course, a new sofa. So. Um, then it was done. I'll give you a brief insight. It's a little bit dark, but this is the dining room. This is the kitchen. Hope you can see it in a way. Uh, living room. Little garden. And of course, in Amsterdam, you need to have your boat in front of the door. And it's branded, of course. So uh, what, what did happen to our budget? It was like 400,000 euros where we had to like, do the whole renovation and also the entire decoration. And then we uh, had to open a new office in Brussels. Um, it was twice the size of my house. So uh, I thought, well, what can we do? We don't have to do that again. If uh, that house cost me 400,000 euros to decorate it, then this will cost me probably 800,000 euros. Let's not go there. That's not very entrepreneurial. So we thought, OK, let's uh, forget that lesson of Scarface and do practice what you preach. So this was the empty space. It was a city center, as I said. Lovely, lovely building, old uh, factory. And um, we asked the stylist, you can do anything with this office. You can buy any design furniture whatsoever, but there's one rule. You have to find it on our own website. So we started, and then we found this design lamp. It cost normally 1,000 euros. We found it for 100 euros, and this beautiful teapot. Actually, we bought it and we went to our visitors. We, we found over 1,000 articles on our own website that, were, you know, that we wanted to have. We talked to these visitors. We went over there. We crossed the entire Belgium. We, we went to hundreds of visitors to buy actually hundreds of articles. And uh, you, know, well, you see here a quick overview of how the office turned out. New desks, new computers, everything secondhand, everything on our own platform. Nice African design sofas, carpets. We have, we found, we even created a bedroom for guests in the in the office, and uh, design chairs. Everything you want to find is there and super cheap. And um, this is um, how it turned out. The office, even some nice decoration from the wall. This is actually the yellow jersey of Tom Bone, the only dope-free uh, cyclist. Uh, well, he says at least. And. Um, this is, uh, yeah, you know, some other overview of the building. A nice roof terrace with a great lounge set. And everything that we did on our own website, you remember that uh, the projected uh, budget was 800,000. 
We did it, the total job, for only 9,400 euros. So this is really practice what you preach, and we told everybody how we did that. So um, we uh, made a blog, we kept the blog, we everything, every uh, people that we visited, every article that we bought, we uh, wrote an article about it and uh, put it on the blog. People started following this, and we got some great exposure here. And we started to educate the Belgian population what you can do, how you can design your house and be very cheap, and everybody started picking that up. Even we took a camera crew to, uh, to every uh, place that we went and we filmed and interviewed the people. We had great stories about uh, the story behind the article, the story behind the people themselves. It was really nice footage and we created a YouTube channel of that. And uh, short form web content, it's a five minute interview with people about their stuff. It was super cool to make it and uh, really nice to watch it as well. People started following this as well, started talking about it. And then, um, then it kind of happened. We got nationwide coverage over this project. We got every, every newspaper wrote about it, every magazine about lifestyle, about furniture, about home decoration wrote about it. Glossies, five pages, ten pages, all year, one after the other, all kind of articles. And even uh, here it says, uh, Tweedans office of Tweedans.be. Um, in French, everything, everybody wrote about it. We were on national TV, we were on the uh, primetime news, national uh, TV shows about uh, the home decoration in the morning, in the evening, it was total madness. And uh, this really, really paid off. So instead of costing us 800,000 euros, it cost us only 9,000 euros, and we got millions worth of, of, of uh, free publicity and media space. So. The thing that I want to prove by this is, you know, is this really marketing? In a way, it is marketing, of course, and you can, you can do everything, you can practice what you preach and you can tell the people about it, but the main thing, and that is for, uh, for us the most important thing, is that we look at it from a visitor's perspective. We want to be in the center of our own product, and this is something that large companies tend to forget. They work towards optimization, monetization, they totally like, squeeze everything out of the platform. While we are looking only for the best, best visitor experience, and the only way to experience that yourself is to be a visitor yourself, to use your own product in that way that the visitors do. And talk to your visit, visitors. As, as I said, we met thousands of people uh, ourselves, recorded everything, and we were one, uh, one of them. We were using our own product in the same way that they do, and that's why we totally understand our own community. So this is not marketing, our product is really in our DNA. So this is one um, lesson that I think in Scarface, uh, they said, never get high on your, on your own supply. My uh, point would be that you have to be, your product has to be in your DNA, and use it yourself as many times as you can. So this is my story, thank you.